Welcome back to Side Note Suplex. This is CJ Styles. Today's topic, rumors for the current Fiend storyline. Will we see two Fiends soon? This article is out of sportswiki.com. The Fiend Bray Wyatt was burnt alive by Randy Orton after he defeated the Fiend in a Firefly Inferno match at the Tables, Ladders, and Chairs pay-per-view event last December. These types of incidents used to be pretty common in the pre-PG era days, but it was pretty shocking to see such an encounter these days. But right now, an interesting rumor that is trending is that the Fiend that returned at Fastlane is not Bray Wyatt. This is a questionable debate, but anyone who looks closely at the Fastlane's Fiend can easily notice that the character is way thinner than Bray. It even looks a little smaller than Bray, height-wise. If that is not Bray Wyatt, then who could it be? There is no news of Bray Wyatt picking up any legit injury that WWE has to replace him under the mask. If this is not Bray, then the storyline must be having some serious change, and they might be preparing for a big twist in the tale soon. A similar incident took place way back in 2017 when Mickie James revealed to be La Luchadora who was costing Becky Lynch match after match. However, reports suggested that Mickie James was not under the mask every time. WWE may have The Fiend as Bray Wyatt ultimately, but it is not impossible that someone else is under the mask right now. Rumors are suggesting that the guy under the mask is none other than Bray's real-life brother, Bo Dallas. Bo is smaller than size than Bray, and many fans have been rooting for Bo Dallas to be included in this Bray Wyatt storyline for a long time. Has the time finally arrived? We seriously hope there is a twist in the tale which makes this storyline much more interesting. So I went back myself and looked at that fiend from Fastlane, and I can see definitely what everyone's saying. That would be a great twist. If you've been paying attention to the Fiend storyline and rumors surrounding it, there was an article that previously came out discussing Bo Dallas becoming another type of character, the Fiend's nicer brother, the Friend. Now this article originally came out in 2019. Amid complaints from advertisers that the Fiend is too scary for younger viewers, WWE plans to reveal the Fiend's kinder, happier brother, the Friend, portrayed by Bo Dallas. A leaked script for an episode of Monday Night Raw back in 2019 had the two brothers bickering backstage using the Let Me In tagline in a zany knock-knock joke sort of way. The duo were rumored to become a tag team called the Fiend and Friend Connection, who baffled their opponents with a bizarre mix of sadistic tactics and wacky goofball antics. And the name is also a ode to the Rock and Sock Connection. Bo Dallas has been Another one of the guys in the back that has not been used for a while, even though he has delivered many times when he was used. But it would be a great way to extend the storyline, to add some more twists and turns. And this is something to think about on the road to WrestleMania, because this is something that could indeed happen at WrestleMania, or possibly the first Raw after Mania. So something to pay attention to. There's many ways that this could be written to tell a intricate tale between the brothers and also a creative way to incorporate the regular Bray Wyatt character. So we can see that Bo Dallas has possibly been discussed in being incorporated in the storyline for a while now. Will this be the time that they do it? Stay tuned to Side Note Suplex for more WWE news as it breaks.